Joining us now, Orioles catcher Adley Let's Rutschman go. from Fenway Park. Adley, we appreciate the time. This is your first opening day. You got a, you got a taste of the bigs, of course, last year. Played extensively, played well. Congratulations. What are your thoughts on your first opening day? Oh, this is awesome. Uh, you know, you, you come into this year and you don't know what to expect. And I woke up this morning and I thought it was just going to be like any other day, but immediately I felt it. <laughs> and uh, I was like, <laughs> I was hoping that it was going to wait at least like two hours before it hit. But um, no, it's already hit. Adley, I'll never forget when you debuted, you went behind the plate and you did a 360 to your to your family in, in the stands just screaming your name. And you kind of just took it all in from that moment. I think it was in May till now. What, what have you learned? Um, I, I guess you just learn how to deal with the day to day. Um, it's a lot of games and, um, you know, you find a way on any day to, to compete and uh, to figure out your swing and uh, just try and find a way to win. But uh, we have a great group and it's been fun and I'm excited for this year. Adley, what's the mindset for you? Is it just stay healthy? Because talking to a lot of guys during this WBC, they're in on you already. The real Mutos, the Will Smiths, they're seeing what you're doing. So is it? Hey, if I post, I'll be fine. No, no, uh, there's no complacency. Uh, we're always trying to get better. And, um, you know, we have a big team focus here. And uh, we're just going to try and stay within ourselves and uh, compete day to day. And um, we'll see what the results are. Adley, I know you work hard on your uh, relationships with your pitchers. How much time have you had with your battery mate today? How comfortable you, are you uh, calling this game today? Uh, I got to catch his last two starts uh, in spring training, um, which were huge. And uh, we've had a lot of conversations over the course of the spring. And so I feel like we got a pretty good idea um, right now. Uh, we'll have a nice little meeting before the game uh, to refine any last minute things. But um, I'm excited. I was just telling the guys in the commercial break, Gunnar Henderson, one of the most impressive young guys in this sport. I got to talk to him in spring. What are your impressions of him and what's your relationship like? Oh, uh, well, Gunnar was actually the first person that I roomed with yeah. uh, when I was in the GCL in 2019 after we both got drafted. And so uh, he was the first guy I met. And, um, you know, it's been awesome to see him develop into the person he got. He was when he got drafted to the person he is now. And uh, always just a, you know, a great Southern boy and uh, with a lot of talent. And so I'm excited to see what this year has to bring for him. Uh, he's going to be fun to watch. Adley, take me inside the new rules. Pitch clock, no shifts. And you probably dealt with it a lot in the minor leagues, but how, how has that adjustment been for a lot of the pitchers and you working with them in spring? Um, everything just feels a lot quicker. Um, you know, I, I think uh, it's going to feel even quicker today on opening day. Uh, a lot of uh, nerves and everything going on. Uh, so we'll see how it goes, but um, we'll just try and keep with pace and uh, make sure we're, you know, getting the right pitch called and everything's early so we can just focus on competing. Adley, the genesis behind your meeting with the pitcher after every half inning, where did that come from? Have you been doing it your whole life since you've been behind the plate? Yeah, yeah. I mean, as long as I can remember. Um, you know, for me, it's just uh, it's been one of those things that, uh, you know, if guys don't like it, they can they can tell me to stop. But, um, <laughs> you know, for me, I'm just I'm excited after good innings and after bad innings. Uh, I want to let them know I'm there for them. And um, for me, it's just one of those things that uh, I've just – you know, I get so excited, so uh, I just want to see him, I guess. But uh, people always ask me where it came from, and I don't know. I don't know. It's just one of those things that kind of happened. All right, let's get it going. Day game, Fenway, breakfast, fuel. <laughs> what are we putting in the tank to get ready for three for four, a couple doubles, maybe a ribby or two? Uh, well, I mean, uh, I, we got a little eggs in, a little scramble going, uh, a little sausage, bacon, peppers, onions, um, get a little smoothie uh, mm -hmm. every day, every day smoothie, and uh, we'll hit a little coffee uh, here when we go back inside, uh, get the juices flowing a little bit, but I don't think we're going to have any trouble with that today. <laughs> eye black? Is it an eye black day? Oh, it's definitely an eye black day. No, I think it's going to be, a, it's gonna be a, a ski mask day. I'm going to have oh, one of those really? uh, things yeah. covered I mean, up. Look, the, look, oh, absolutely. You can see his breath. It's a little chilly out here. Ski yeah, a little, little chilly out here, but. Can we go ahead the, and You know, a, like the. On Fenway? No. <laughs> yeah, Adley, don't you think they should put a roof over Fenway? I mean, come on, what are we doing here? No, we got the uh, sun shining today. It's, it's warm in your mind. 
ski mask day. Hey, Adley, we appreciate you joining us. Thanks for braving the elements. Good luck to you today, and best of luck in 2023. Thank you, guys. I appreciate you having me on.